In this video, we will discuss a statistical quantity called the confidence interval. We will look at how it's defined and clarify some misconceptions about it. So what is confidence interval? It is an interval estimate of a population parameter that provides some level of confidence regarding coverage of the true parameter. An interval estimate is defined by a lower bound and an upper bound. The confidence level is the fraction of intervals derived from repeated applications of the same sampling and estimation procedure that encompass the true parameter. Let's take a look at what it means. We have a population with a distribution parameter theta. We can draw a random sample from it and apply an estimation procedure to obtain an interval estimate defined by a lower bound and an upper bound. If we were to repeat this procedure of sampling and estimation, we can get multiple copies of the interval estimate and plot them on the chart. The yellow vertical line represents the true value of the population parameter theta. We can plot the interval estimates as line segments in this chart. Some of these intervals cover the true value theta, while others do not. In this particular example, 8 out of the 10 interval estimates cover the true value theta, while 2 of them do not cover it, so the confidence level is 80%. There is a common misconception that a 95% confidence interval covers the true parameter with 95% probability. The correct interpretation is as follows. If the sampling and estimation procedure were repeated for multiple times, the 95% of the calculated confidence intervals would cover the true parameter. This is confidence interval in a nutshell. Thank you for watching. See you next time.